Dallas Card Show on a Saturday is the craziest time. This is where the most foot traffic happens, the best deals, and the greatest trade night of the year. We're gonna be buying from across the table. We're gonna go live. We're gonna hit the dollar boxes today. We're gonna do a little bit of everything. Send them off to sell these. We got the Volpe. Oh, Cam. Derek Carr. Yeah. Mortola. Oh yeah, that's a banger. And yep, we're gonna I'm gonna let you move the Brady. The Brady, if you can get 3k out of this, sell it. The Shea Gilgis Alexander, if you can get above 1200, I need you to get a buck fifty on that, around two fifty on that, and I need above five hundred on this, or else we're not selling it. What's your favorite Taylor Swift song? I'm ready for it. Okay, you had to think about it. That wasn't like you didn't know. You had to really think about it. It's all you. That's yours. We're naming the song. You're true. <laughs> You'll appreciate it more than I am. Thank you. And she was in our stream yesterday. What was your name? Madeline. Madeline. So Madeline was in my stream yesterday, and she was really into the Taylor Swift card. I was hoping you'd come by. No matter what, I was gonna give it to you. That's why I told you to come back. And I was like, yeah, it's all you. I could have sold that for 20 bucks, but what's what's 20 bucks gonna give me when the priceless face and her experience, this is what the card shows and like card shop experiences. You gotta give people a good experience so they come back to the hobby. She'll, whether she sell, like she obviously gonna keep it, but hopefully she goes to more shows and she pays it forward and she remembers that experience and passes it to the next person. That's important. So that's what drives the hobby forward. Keep it moving, keep it healthy. Nothing is better than the dollar box deals at the Dallas Card Show. Specifically, Red Earth Sports Cards, AKA Jeff Coopit. They got hit hard. Let's look for some deals. Here we go. Oh, Damian Pierce Red, that's cool. Already found a card I like. Trey Lance, I lost lost bad on him. Tommy Tremble Blue out of 99. We're taking all numbered cards we can. Miles Gaskin, Carol Baskin. So typically we're gonna see a lot of mosaic in these. I'm not trying to spend a dollar each on these. I, the more I buy, hopefully I can get this down to 50 cents a card based on buying you know, over 500 cards. So when you're going through these, you wanna build a big pile. And I'm gonna look for PC cards. We're gonna look for numbered cards that we can flip. Cool cards, just cards that look cool. Ben Gordon, all right, I'll snag this. Desmond Ritter. One year ago today, we were buying this guy's cards for $100, $150 per RPA. His RPA now is about $20 to $25. Desmond Ritter was not him, and I thought he would be. Jake Funk, blue, at 9 and we'll take that. He was huge, DK Metcalf. I don't know what happened. Dalvin Cook out of 100, pretty cool. Some people are different, like, you might not be able to use a lot of these cards because you're not selling on whatnot. Some people are looking for their PC cards. Everybody here is looking for something different. If I find any Kelsey or Mahomes cards, I'll pass them to you. Well, thank you. If you find any uh, DeMarcus Cousins or Aaron Rodgers, I need you to pass them to me. You got it. It's teamwork makes the dream work, baby. Yeah. All right, here's a Patrick Mahomes. No way. Yeah, there you go. Oh, wow. Hey, Jeff, I'm gonna buy this for her. Mac Jones absolutely fell apart. So, I mean, look at that. I've gone through without much. I would say at least 50 cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's 11 cards right here. Five dollars and fifty cents for those 11 cards. Dwayne Haskins, rest in peace. Good things going. Hey, out of 25, Zonovan Knight. Not sure who he is, but. Oh, that's a fluorescent. Fluorescent out of 25. Hello, Dad. What's up? Yeah, how's the donut shop? Oh man, okay. What are they buying? What kind of donuts were were sold the most? Okay, you're giving me the real inventory. Were there any maple bars left, Dad? They're out of maple bars. Mm -hmm. All right, if you guys are ever in Granite Bay or Sacramento, go up to Bill's Donuts in Granite Bay. It's my dad's donut shop. It's been around since 1986. Go get yourself a maple bar. Use the code MOJO, and it'll give you a free donut hole. My dad doesn't understand sports cards at all. All we watch is the World Cup. Never watched basketball, never played catch, but my dad and I would always watch the World Cup. That was one thing we did. He's 63 years old, and he still makes donuts till three in the morning. Always take the call from your parents. Uh, if you still have them. You know, I've heard that from a lot of people. You know, obviously I, I had lost my sister in 2016 and I wish I could take that call again. So I always, when my parents call, it's not even for the video, I always answer when my mom and dad call. That's just the thing. Find a couple Rogers cards. The thing about it, man, is like for 50 cents, 75 cents to get an Aaron, a couple Aaron Rogers cards for my PC, it's priceless. Terrence Newman, wow. Oh, out of 14.99. That's a good one. Jermaine Johnson, oh, out of 175, that's a cool one. That's See, his, all these numbered cards are great, man. That's I, his rookie. That's, that's his rookie, wow. Because yeah. I go to Burbank every week, and I'm telling you right now, $2 to $50 at Burbank gets hammered out pretty good. Like, that's the best price point right now. I think in 
one, the economy, two, the sports card market, between two and fifty dollars is magic right now, which you love to see it. It's affordable price points for everybody. Not everybody can spend a one thousand to fifteen hundred dollars on a sports card. Even I'm hesitant to spend thousands of dollars on cards right now, unless it's like the goats, like Brady, Tiger Woods, Wayne Gretzky, Kobe Bryant, Demarcus Cousins, Charles Cross. He's an offensive tackle, but it's a color match blue. My mom's a Seahawks fan. I'm thinking of her, so I'll buy that. Sam Darnold, he just got signed. That's Carlos Hyde Blue just snuck in there. I'll grab that. I don't know where the, I don't know where that came from. Wow. Is it numbered? Yeah. It is numbered? Yeah, blue out of 99. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I mean, that's $10 for 20 cards right there. I want to pay 50 cents each. He'll honor it if I buy enough cards. Right now, we need to we need to buy more, but this is a nice stack of football. Tony Hawks. What? For a dollar? Oh my gosh, oh, look at that. Way. Tony Hawk Relic, Tony Hawk Collection, used skateboards. These would be sick sign. Oh, yeah. He's a great signer. I could do a kickflip and Tony Hawk Pro Skater too. Skyler Thompson, he had a little run. He started while we were here on a Sunday and everyone was freaking out. I have memories at card shows of players booming in one day and then never going back to that. Skyler Thompson, Josh Johnson from the Niners, JD had his co contenders I, auto. I had such a moment to be able to <laughs> to be able to to capitalize because I bought his X Practor for like four bucks on eBay, Dude. and then he subbed in for Brock when he messed up his arm during the playoffs, and then literally the second play he gets a concussion. We were in Atlanta, just like that. We were in Atlanta for that. I'm telling you, <laughs> Sam Ellinger, everyone was on his stuff. And then, uh, what's that guy's name from the Colts? Jacob Eason, I've seen it all. Bull Bull, Kobe White during COVID, Zion and Jaw, like, I'm talking, Zion and Jaw, they're great. They're still good, but like the guys that like, they had a chance and the hobby freaked out and then like, no, no, it's crazy. You know, I'm a big advocate for buying singles over, you know, boxes and breaks. And the reason why is because somebody else is gonna, somebody else is gonna open this and I could buy it for a dollar. Campbell Blue at a 2.99. Look at this one. Billy White Shoes Johnson. What a name. Jake DeLome out of 250 playing against Tom Brady. Dang, that's a cool one. Probably my favorite one, Shaquem Griffin out of 275. Like, look at this Mark Brunel. Looks like a movie ticket. How are you? Hey, How are you? I watch you on um, YouTube. You're on the YouTube right I now. I collect um, baseball football cards from my grandson. I started with my grand, my son, 1975. I got out of it, yeah. and, and I got back into it in the 80s. Yeah. And then I was scrolling along YouTube, and I seen you there, and I was like, oh my god, I gotta get back. I gotta collect cards for my grandson now. Debbie, nice to meet you. Debbie, nice to meet we'll you probably too. Be, we'll probably be here for three hours, so if, you, if you're oh, really? looking for us, I'm gonna be sitting right here looking through the boxes. Oh. These are the best deals. Great to meet you. <laughs> Thank you, nice to meet you. Nice too. to meet you. Yeah. That's so cool. Thank I mean, you awesome. so much for all your, you know, all the stuff you put on, um, YouTube. It's helped me so a lot. I get my grandkids to sit there with me and watch it, you know, like, come here! Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> yeah. I really love that. You're awesome. Today, it's all about, is it in a slab? Is it a nine? If it's a seven or a six or five, nobody wants it. You know, there has to be a ten. And that's just a shame that they don't get the real feel of the hobby itself. I believe in that. It's cool. I'll take those. Defense, you know, the hobby doesn't get, def the defense doesn't get hobby love, but by defensive players that I like because I played defense when I played football so it's, it's more of like a personal choice to buy that card. Dang, Bill Romanowski at a 99, that's a great card. Mark Gastineau, that's sick. Found the Travis Kelsey. There you go, buy what you like. I get lost in these. There was a time in Dallas. Jeff, what do you think, eight hours I spent here? There it is, Rogers, Cal Berkeley, Silver. I'll pick that up for the PC. Christian McCaffrey, Green, Chain Movers. I'll save that for somebody else. Jay Ajayi, Green, that's a great looking card. Montez Sweat, Red. Julio Jones at a 199, Cordell Patterson at 125. Some of this stuff too, like we'll put in our care packages. When you guys mail me something in my PO box and you send me a card, I like to throw a couple of those back to you guys. So a lot of this too, some of it is freebies and some of it's just cool cards I think we can give away. Man, this is like a downtown optic without being a downtown optic right here. Matt Stafford. What's up, man? Jabari Parker. This guy was supposed to be so good at, from Duke University for the Milwaukee Bucks. It did not happen. I'm gonna buy this as a memory to 2014 and 15. I went to the NBA Summer League, and guess who was in the Summer League and nobody talked about it? 
Giannis Antetokounmpo was in that draft class. Basically, all I'm saying is I went to the summer league when Jabari played Andrew Wiggins and they shut the gym down. Somebody correct me in the comments. All I know is I went to NBA Summer League every year since, I think it was Bennett's first year. All right, Bennett was 2013, so that was Giannis's. So Jabari was the year after with Andrew Wiggins. Rodney Harrison, absolute beast for the Patriots. Matt Judon, and then this is cool, Deshaun Jackson, color match green. I always buy color matches. Shout out to my husband, Harry, at home back in North Carolina. I'm here. Hey, she's here, she's hustling, with she's getting Mojo. good cards. Let's go. <laughs> Debbie and I are hustling the boxes out. Here we go. We got basketball. All right, basketball and football mix. Oh my gosh, Jimmer Fredette at a 599 for the PC. Let's go. Oh, Udonis Haslam at a 499 color match red. Miami Heat. Derrick Rose rookie card. Let's go. That's a sick one. Man, Luol Dang at a 349. He was good at one point. Karam Butler at a 349. Demarcus Cousins off the color for the PC. A lot of my PCs are at my parents' house, like Demarcus, Aaron Rodgers. So I started a, new, a couple new boxes in, living in LA. So I don't really have that many cards. So I'm trying to build those PCs up. So technically I'm kind of recollecting them again. Aaron Donald, happy retirement. Hey, shout out to Jeff Wilson. Here he is, Will Greer. Jeff, I'm gonna buy that and I need you to sign it. What do you guys think of Will Levis? Curious what everybody thinks about him. Aaron Donald, I'm gonna buy that. Happy retirement. That's him getting Jimmy G. Dang, destroyed. All right, baseball is a whole nother ball game. There's a couple of reasons why. There are a lot of baseball cards. There's a lot of young prospects and I don't know baseball that well. So this is kind of where I wish I was live so I could have people give me some feedback. Matt McLean. Some of these I might just buy because we need some baseball inventory. Refractors, Brandon Barrera. Barrea. I do like this kid a lot, Cam Collier from the Reds. Because either way, so you, wait, how many cards do you have? 12? 12. So what would, what would be your offer? I would say $8. $8? Okay, you're fair. Offer five, then he could say seven or eight. Dude, this is a cool card. Oh, snap. Chris Bryant, Jonathan Clayus. Isn't this guy supposed to be good Mariners? Uh-oh. He's supposed to be. He didn't hit last year. So that's, that's like the hobby show. That dude was on top of the world last year. He hit like, I think 220 last season. So now it's kind of gone down. See, that's my, my perception, right? I heard people talk about him last year. I got to update my knowledge. I just asked him. There are just so many amazing people in this hobby. Like we harp on the negativity, but there's more positive than negative. It's all perception and attitude at this point, especially in life, business, cards. He brought me a Celsius sparkling grape brush. I wasn't trying to drink these, but I need a little kick today because it's Saturday. And I stayed up editing last time, I'm really tired. Dude, look at Greg Maddox in the glasses. Are you kidding me? How much would you pay for this Sidney Crosby 10? Look at all these Maybe golf cards. Minutes. Jack, Arnold Palmer. All right, pausing the dollar boxes. So Monster's back, man, he's buying it all. I finally found good bins. Dang, Chet Holgram, Red Ice, Keldon Johnson Auto, Mon Trumper. Dang, 86 mm -hmm. Fleers. Dang, dang. Deion Sanders and the Yankees. For 20 bucks, for say nine. Man, the Jordan's sick. Let's go. Killing it, man, the disposal. Yeah. These are all gonna be on our whatnots. We're gonna run all these at a dollar. Got some fire stuff. These Otanis are gonna be great. We'll run some free giveaways on these as well on our whatnots. Tap into that link down below, get your first $10 spent on us. Let's go do some more deals. Call the buyer in the house. Look at What's that up, merch. Guys? What's up? That's a beauty. What's this worth? It's like six grand. Sheesh. What do you guys think of CJ Stroud? We got a little Justin Herbert, NTRPA. And then out. holy smokes, Connor McGregor, one of one I black. Hey, what's this? How much? Honestly, it's it's hard to tell, but I think it's like three grand right now. When's the fight getting announced? Hopefully soon, though. Mally just did nine grand. You opened a 2023 Tops MLS yes, sir. and pulled this, and you just announced to me, you already redeemed it. Who's the player they announced? Messi, on card. So what are you going to do with it? Well, I redeemed it, so I'll uh, figure it out when I get it. What do you think it's worth? I have no idea. All right, what do you guys think it's worth? One of one messy redemption auto. Yeah. You came over Thursday, and you did the video uh, of my showcases, and there was a Derek car in there. The guy seen it on the video, found it today, and bought the car, full price. I wanted to thank you. You're Appreciate welcome. that. Man, let's go. That's awesome, bro. Thanks. Hey, I'm glad. That's cool, man. It's crazy how many people watch the videos, and they'll find something they like. Based was, off of our videos. That was from the live? Yeah, it's that was from our live stream. That's the hobby right there. I want to see people win, and that guy really wanted that card. We're the Andrew Luck collectors. 250, 200 on a coin flip. Uh, this could be the worst sports card investment I'll make all year. He's getting me. What? 175 versus how much? 
Two seventy five. Two seventy five. Where I'm either gonna get these for five bucks each, or I'm getting them for nine and a half. Rock paper scissors shoot. Oh. Rock paper scissors shoot. Oh. Rock paper scissors shoot. I'm buying this guy's entire Andrew Luck collection. If this was 2012, I'd be so rich right now. Either way, between 175 and 275. All right, Liam, you're gonna flip the coin. It's gonna land on the floor. I'm gonna okay. call it in the air. All right, go ahead. Tails. Oh! Oh my oh, goodness. Yes, no. Thank you, Liam. Hey. I appreciate it. Uh, $100 coin for it, yeah. I'm not eating. I'm, I'm gonna eat top ramen for a week now in LA. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! He tipped him. <laughs> oh my hey, god! There you go. Geo, shout out to Geo. I'm signing this. What is it? 2024 tops. One of one. Boom. Fire. I love it. I, I watched you and Justin like you know, while I was away, and I was like, dude, I can't wait to get back and start going. Oh, and I saw that you were signing favorite cards. So oh, like, bro, of course. And if you want, hey, if you send me a card of your favorite player team, you sign it and send it to me in my PO box. I'm collecting your guys' uh, dude, autos. Heck yeah. Send me like a Ranger or something. Dude, yeah, for sure. Blue yeah. Refractor. Oh, He's so cool. He collects yeah, cards I, too. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Andrew Luck, I'm begging you, bro. I need you to come back to the NFL. I bought all this and I lost a huge coin flip. Just come back for like 10 days to the NFL. Join the Patriots, please. You're amazing. How you doing, bro? Dude, you always make me smile. Hey. I, I love that hoodie, by the way. Thank you, my wife got this for me. She's tired of seeing the old Bronco stuff, so. Hey, love it. To bring up. And how's life, everything good? No complaints, man. No complaints. Loving it, loving Let's it. Go. Hey, appreciate you. Tracy Hacker, legend. I, if you talk to me about hobby heroes, that's the guy right there. I say it all the time, Tracy Hackler started at Panini. I used to watch all the unwrapped videos with him and Scott Prusha. Unbelievable oh personality. They're so they're so well connected with the players. I mean, shoot, they were probably working this rookie premiere with Andrew Luck. It's amazing, and he's just walking around hanging out. So I have high regards for Tracy. He's the man, definitely one of my role models. So I love, love seeing him when I can. Cards, you already know. Check out his eBay, he's booming right now. Starting Dang, the hobby, right. grind, let's go. What'd you bring me? Let's go. Community blend coffee. So this is chicory. New Orleans style coffee and medium roast. We'll take it, bro. Let's go. I'm gonna shout you out on the whatnots. Word. Let's go. Mentacious in the house. So I told you I got you some swag. You ain't got never. You ain't never seen anything like this. Oh snap, bro. We got a full jersey. Look at this. I feel like it's like an esports team. Wow, that's sick. Dang, look at that. One of one. That is sick. DBO Sports. They're on Facebook. Yeah. They're the ones that uh, made it. He's a vet, he's a service member, wow. a buddy of mine. So he yeah. does this, and he gets them made. Man, so. if I if I if we got jerseys, would you guys buy them? <laughs> These are sick, bro. I'm pumped. Thank you, bro. You're the man. And I got my IG in the back. So. That's sick. Wow. I'm selling them. Yeah. Wow. He's gonna total us up. We're done at the dollar boxes. We didn't spend eight hours here. We spent around an hour, which I think is exactly enough time to dig through the dollar boxes. We didn't find any case hits. We didn't find any Brock Purdy rookies. I spent a lot of money on Andrew Luck, which um, I'm not happy about, but it's all good. It's good vibes here at the Dallas Card Show. Like I said, if you ever come to the Dallas Card Show, just walk in through that main entrance, walk all the way down, and it's some of the best dollar boxes you'll find. Mm -hmm. And Jeff is a great guy to deal with. As he's totaling me up for payment, I compliment him. I'm hoping to get 10% off each card, no. All right, Jeff and I got a deal. Paid around uh, 75 cents, 80 cents per card, pretty good. Thanks for the deal. Thank you again. There you go. Boom, get some change. Thank you. I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like, leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe. It's a great time here at the Dallas Card Show. You having fun? Oh, always. Always, man. Thanks for your service. Yeah, thank Appreciate you. you. Always a good time here. If you guys need a Zion case, use my code MOJO10. Also, I'm live on Whatnot every single week on Wednesdays at 4.30 Pacific. I hope I can see you guys there. It's an absolute vibe. We got Zach streaming, I'm streaming, and Ty who is also streaming on Sundays. So tap into our whatnots. I've been noticing the trend. It says subscribe versus not subscribe, and it's really hurting my feelings. Guys, I need to make sure, you guys need to make sure you're subscribed. We need to get to that 50K mark. It would mean a lot to me. And you know, the road to 100K starts, hopefully before the national.